madness. What? It's all madness. It's all madness. So? So what? You know what? Don't act I'm all. I'm not acting. I'm just sitting. This is a great chance for you, Walter. This Bible that we're selling, it's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to have an intimate conversation with God. You can work on your problems, fix your relationships, work out all the kinks in your life for only $49.95. But tell me you can find a deal like that somewhere else. Keep your goddamn Bible stuff to yourself in here. I won't have it. Don't tell me you're not a man of God. You need to repent. Imbue yourself in the cleansing light of God. Walter, you need this Bible. How dare you? Trying to sell me salvation through a bloody textbook? From the bloody past? No, no. Walter, please consider... Consider what? A 30-year-old punk? Selling Bibles with a mommy complex? And you want to tell me how to live my life? You say you're a messenger of God? Well, where'd he go? He doesn't care about you or me or anybody. He's an imaginary entity. An absentee father just like yours! Enough! Now, just because you have chosen to be a ranting, raving, dirty old man holed up in a dirty apartment, howling, screaming and yelling because your wife and kids left you on account that you're dirty, filthy, old fucking drunk, doesn't mean you can take that out on me. I'll take it out on anything I goddamn well want to! You sit there like a martyr with your messianic attitude, shtick, ruse, act, whatever you want to call it. The truth is, you're nothing but a little worm crawling around in the primordial ooze because that's what you are, an invertebrate. And you sit there with your greased back hair and your $20 thrift store suit. You're scum, slime of the earth, a parasite who feeds off the goodwill of others. You say, I'm not a man of God. You're the devil's secretary, playing with the lives of those who don't know better. My wife left me 22 years ago, took the kids and ran off. And now I'm stranded in this hellhole. And I can't stand it. Sometimes I wish I could just end my misery and kill myself. But I always find an excuse not to. But I'm just a coward. I'm afraid of death. I'm afraid of life. I'm afraid of the things I can do. I feel powerful. I feel immortal. Like a great ultimate being. And I spit in the face of evil. I am evil. I am the devil. I am God. I am everything ever created. I am a man. 